Signs of destruction were visible at the popular Igbo business area along Otaru Palace Road, Auchi, where the accident occurred. Several vehicles and motorcycles were badly damaged due to the impact of the accident. Confusion enveloped the area as residents and shop owners took to their heels to avoid being caught in the accident. An eyewitness told the news crew that the trailer conveying cement developed mechanical fault resulting in brake failure before crashing into stationary vehicles and commercial motorcyclists. The eyewitness said construction on the other side of the dualized road was ongoing when the accident occurred. The security man or taxi driver noticed that there is no brake in that truck. When he entered the first speed breaker, the second one, he slowed it down small. The driver went to him. He told the call the driver, you observe that there's no brake in this truck. He said, yes, please park this truck in the palace. Park the truck in the palace. The driver refused. And he still bring the truck to town. And as he was coming, the driver was following him behind. It was his presence. Those things happened. Before I could go to him, the driver jumped out from the car and escaped from the truck and escaped. That's see there. Now cry, now they cry. It's just the clear people they go, the clear people they go. Even though the man self wait inside the trailer, he fly come out, motor just the clear people they go. Wait I see. What did they happen for this load? May they can't know what did they happen for this load. We don't need trailer for this road. We don't need trailer. Is that too much? Some residents who lamented the unfortunate incident have on the need for construction or speed breakers on the road to avert a recurrence. So just that Otaru, Otaru in council and his uh, cabinet should put a barricade concerning trailers and other uh, tent tires, tipper from floppy, coming to out. If not, all this accident will never be stopped. Let them put stop to that place. And look at this place now. Look at any truck that's come, come from Otaru Palace, always land here. And that thing, it always be problem to community here. They should stop banding those trailers to be bringing goods. Whatever they're bringing goods, they should come later the night or early in the morning, then should discharge and go off. So government should please help the community so that there will be no uh, uh, entry of uh, heavy duty trucks inside the community again. Speed breakers here. You can see the lost we encountered this morning. Personnel of the Federal Road Safety Corps and officials of the Red Cross Society were on the ground to rescue victims. Walem Siama reporting.